Okay guys and welcome back to the Our Family channel. If you are new to this channel, I am Sarah, I am mum of 11 children now. 11 children, it seems crazy to even say that. Anyway, if you know, welcome and hi from our house to your house. Anyway, I thought we'd do a little like present haul because I've not vlogged much the last couple of days I've just been trying to juggle and I don't know what it is when you have a newborn baby it's like you just cannot get a routine and even when you think you've got one it's gone bye bye it's it's just not happening <laughs> so it's not that we've not got a routine in the house it's just hard like trying to make sure everybody's dressed in the morning the beds are all made the house is tidy and then you've got breakfast and then by the time you've done breakfast it's feed the baby and by the time you've fed the baby it's dinner time and by the time it's dinner time it's time to feed the baby again and by the time you've done that and it's just like a roller coaster of feeding 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 the bigger kids feeding the baby and yeah it's just been a little bit crazy we're, we're trying though and you know what i've had the perfect opportunity to pick the camera up i'm not gonna lie but i just find it so stressful it's like i've got 10 million things going on in my head and don't know how to organize it so i've been trying the last couple of days just kind of took a bit of time away from the camera i think because like i've been vlogging with the baby and everything obviously i'm still doing like little stories on the channel so um on the instagram so if you're not on our instagram please head on over there because if i'm not vlogging then i will put little stories up or we'll check in through instagram or i have tried to start doing a little bit more on there so if i'm not vlogging you're still kind of seeing something that we're doing through the day but yeah so i'm trying to obviously grow the channel now and not just because we've had a baby because that's not what we want to do but we want to do a lot of adventures and go on holidays and stuff like that we want to share that with you guys you know and obviously we want to let you guys see like aurora and vanellope and the other kids and the new baby growing up because that's a part of our life so but yeah anyway i just thought i'd check in and show you a couple of things that we were bought for mini main and obviously there was a couple of things bought for me i'm not too sure whether you've seen the hamper that imogen got me she got me that for mother's day which kind of did it for me and mini main she asked me what i wanted and there isn't very much that i needed then because i was so big and um, being pregnant and quite heavily pregnant that there was no point in getting clothes because it wouldn't have fit and obviously i want to lose weight and stuff so i just said to her why don't you just do like a hamper or do something nice for me and the baby and then we can use it so that's what she did but if you didn't see it there is a vlog for mother's day and i more or less show you everything that was in the basket anyway but i will leave a picture here and i think like i got bath bombs in it I've got baby shampoo soaps um there was clothes for Minnie Mae. There's a couple of pictures. I think she's oh she's wore two of the set. She wore one, which is this picture, and then she wore this one. I'm not too sure whether I've got a picture of her in the other one, but I'll have a look if we have I'll insert it. It was when we went out for the day, she wore the River Island like pink suit. I did show it on the vlog. You will be able to see it on there. But anyway, I'm not gonna carry on rambling on. I do apologise that we've not vlogged very much. I am going to try and get my ass in gear. As of this week, obviously the kids go back to school on Monday and I've got so much that I want to do with the kids, but I've just got so much that I, I really want to get done in the house so I can spend that time concentrating on doing stuff with the kids because I kind of have been feeling really emotional last couple of weeks where I feel like I'm not doing enough with the kids. I know there's a there's a few of them and you know trying to divide your time between them all is quite difficult but I just don't I don't feel like I'm giving an, as much attention as I should be as a mum. Um I mean obviously everyone says oh you do your best and you know but as a parent you know when you can see that your kids want that little bit more of attention especially vanilla so i'd really want to try and like do some stuff with her like even 
school stuff, even just sitting down with her and learning or making something or doing like a little science experiment or cooking and stuff like that and sharing that with you guys. So, oh, but yeah, it's been a crazy two and a half weeks, I'll tell you that. But I have loved every minute of it and I'm just like, hmm, I could do this again. <laughs> Although I'm too old now, so it probably won't happen. But anyway, I'm just going to show you some of this stuff. So, it's quite a bit of it. Um, but yeah, should we do it? Should we just do it? Should we just give Minnie May baby rubber? <laughs> I've been like, mmm, should we do it? But no, I've got too much plan now. We've bought to Florida for next year, it is official. So we're going to talk about that in the next probably week or so. We'll sit down and do a little video because the kids have got so many things that I we've been twice already but there's so much that we didn't do when we went over there there's so much stuff we didn't taste and obviously we wasn't vlogging then and feel absolutely gutted that we we didn't i mean even when we went over there i said today before we went should we vlog should we video like everything so we've got it as memories and we just never did there's no point dwelling on it now but i really wish that we would have done because it would have been so good to look back and see the kids enjoying themselves and they were on tiny then as well so but obviously we've got pictures and stuff but i suppose like if there's one piece of advice that i can give to anyone take as many videos of your kids as you can it doesn't matter if they look dirty or is it not dressed properly because I sit there now and I wish that I would have done so much especially with the girls when they were younger obviously we didn't have great phones then I did have a camcorder and I think I've got some footage of the kids when they were younger um I can't remember where the the memory things are of the camcorder I'll have to see if I can find them and if I can we'll have to sh like share some of the old little videos when the kids were very very young Chelsea and Chloe anyway um, and Liam and I'm not too I'm not even too sure whether we've got any of Imogen I can't remember we've got pictures and stuff but there's just that many of them I just don't even know I think so, most of them are at least so anyway I'm just going to keep rambling out I'm just trying to think who all these presents are off now because in fact we got this one so this came the other day and it is a little Tesco's outfit I think it's from Tesco's because I think we got the other one to this Chloe got us another one um but in like the cream color which I'll show you shortly but we got this it says born in 2022 and it's just striper which is just adorable I love these baby girls anyway so but this came from one of our subscribers Ali so I just want to say thank you to Ali for sending this to us um, we really do appreciate it and we will make sure we get plenty of pictures of her in this once she fits into it which will probably be in the next week or so if I'm honest because she's getting so big I can't believe she's two and a half week old and almost I'd say in another week the first size baby stuff she'll she would have grown out of it and I'm just, just sad it's so sad um just trying to think now what we've got here okay so this was off frank and sue so i'm just going to show you these so we got this little rattle which is an elef elephant i think it's from nexus i'm not too sure maybe this isn't I'm not, but I, can't, I don't know most of the stuff in here is from nexo and gathering she probably got that from there or she picked that up from somewhere else um there's also this little baby grow which is just adorable this says little sister and i think i better put this on her because i don't even know what size that is i'm not even checked because i know she did say she got one first size um and then she got the others that's up to oh, up to 10 pounds so she'll get a bit of air out of that but this is so cute so if anybody wants to get one of these this is from next baby um the stuff in there is just amazing she's got this little cardigan which has got little bunny ears on i think she got this in a bigger size just because she said i bet everyone's bought you like small stuff so this is up to three months so this is up to 14 pounds so she's gonna get plenty of wear out of that 
little cardigan. Although it's scary looking at that because that means she's getting big. <laughs> um, and then there was this pack of three baby rolls. Is it? Oh yeah, three. So you get. I'm not sure whether you can see them, but there's. I'm gonna just kind of take them off. I think it'll be easier. So this is the first one, and it's just got like rabbit detail on it, which is really adorable. And then you get the pink floral one, which is so cute. The colours on these are so nice. And then this one. Like I said, these are from Next and they're in size up to three months. I think the rest of it is up to three months. And then there is this little Peter Rabbit outfit, which I think Sue and Frank got us this, if I'm sure. I can't remember. Um... I don't know if they did or they didn't. I can't remember. If it if it wasn't, then I will correct myself. But I've just had that much stuff sent to me that I just can't remember. I'm starting to think that that's not off Sue and Frank. I'm thinking that this... I'm thinking that this came off Mason's girlfriend, if I'm honest. I think it did. I'm not 100% sure. Um because she got me a present and the baby a present so i think this may have been off her but i will i will correct myself in the video if i'm wrong i just can't i've put everything in the same boxes and just can't remember whose was whose this was also off sue and frank this was in the bag i just forgot to show it you but this is from next so yeah in fact i think that one might have come from sue and this one might have come oh i don't know anyway this is one of the presents as well that we got but and then we got these little outfits from obviously a wedding that i did they bought this for the baby when they came and picked up their memory cards because we've become quite good friends um with them and then there is this little vest, a little hat to match it with mittens, and then a little bib with a flower on the front. That's up to three months also. She's got so much stuff. And then these are from a friend over the road. Um, and this was the little card that it came on, the little postcard. It just says, to Sarah, Dave and kids, congratulations to all and welcome to the world, little lady, Jude and Barry. And that's them over the road. So I'm going to keep this, obviously, because it's really, really sweet. I'm going to put that in a drawer, actually. And she got us four bibs. These are from Next as well. So you've got this little bunny set. In fact, this will go with that other stuff and then there's just a floral one and then another like flowery one and then another one with bunnies on they're just so cute seriously there is just so much i'm gonna be so gutted when she grows out of these and then there is some matching hats to go with them how cute and yeah they're from next as well um so, Mason's girlfriend got us a present, which I'm thinking it was a Peter Rabbit one, because I can't think of what else it would have been. And she also brought me a little present, which is the Baylor's and Harding set. So it's got um, it's got shower gel, body lotion and body wash, and then a body butter, and then it's got a little scruncher. And then it comes also with this like personal carry bag and then you've also got a makeup bag inside of this so that we can see it so i'm going to use that when we go on holiday which will be good because i can keep everything in there special liquids and stuff so we, we will definitely know that nothing is going to leak onto like clothes and stuff which will be good this is what we got off chloe and curse um so this is the same kind of set that the babe the baby grow is in fact but this is a sleep vest for the summer so it's got mittens sleep vest and then it's got the little 
sleeping bag to match it which is just super cute i absolutely love this all the colors on it as well um how cute i'm sure chloe bought this so if she ever gets pregnant she can have it back <laughs> obviously not the best um but the sleeping bag so but yeah anyway put them over there and chloe and kurt has also got a, this little cute outfit with a little headband i love these so much with the little headbands in fact i think this is up to one month as well so we better start getting some wear out of them aren't we otherwise we're not going to get very much i've got pins and needles in my feet i'm sat in vanellope's room because i wanted to do this earlier on today and just never got round to it so if you can't see me i do apologize i'm trying to sit as high as i can to this camera okay so we got this from another subscriber which is karen wallace and it's a little set of baby dresses and oh my god i'm just so in love with these i'm, I'm gonna put one of these on it tomorrow actually because these are really tiny and i think she's not gonna get much wear out of these because these are up to seven seven point eight and she's almost eight pounds so she's not going to get very many wears out of this i might even get a pair of leggings to go with them or something so it's more like a top she might get a bit more wear out of it then um i think her arms are a little bit shorter as well than her legs so but i don't know we'll we'll still get some use out of them but these are so cute so you get this one at the front which has got bunnies and cats on it and then the little rainbow one for the back which is so cute i love them they're so they're so amazing so i just want to say thanks to karen for sending us them they're absolutely beautiful if they don't fit what i'm going to do is i'm going to try one on her and obviously because it's still got the packaging I hope you don't mind Karen, but because they're so beautiful, you know, I want her to get some wear out of them. And if they're too small, what I will do is see if we can take them back to next and see if they'll exchange it for the next size. Because obviously they've still got labels on, so they're not, I can't see them saying no. Um, so I hope you don't mind. I'm just letting you know, just in case you think I'm being cheeky. But obviously, you've, if you've bought something, I want her to be able to wear it, so... I'll try it on her tomorrow, see whether we're going to get a little bit of wear out of it. If not, then we will take it and see if we can get it exchanged. Um, if not, not to worry. And then we were sent this by another subscriber, which is Tony. Um, I've shown this in a previous vlog, but I just wanted to show it again just because, you know, it was a gift that was sent. It's a mini set. Um and it's just so cute she messaged me and she said i've seen this and i just knew that you'd love it so she would definitely fit into that in the summer because that is three to six months so she's got a couple of summer outfits now to wear um right these oh, in fact i'm going to show you this one this is a present from carl and nikki over the road so I'm going to show you them. These, this is a set of. It says baby girl. Mm, wrong way. Baby girl cut cutlery set, and you get the little spoon, knife. Sorry, fork, spoon, knife, and look at the detail on them. They're so cute, and they're by Les Lesar and Pave. If anybody wants to go and buy some, really, really cute. And oh my god, seriously, check this gift bag out it says your precious daughter and it's got loads of little pictures it says small things the smallest things in life 10 tiny fingers 10 tiny toes and a button nose can fill your heart with joy and it's got these pictures on the front and oh my god how cute is that seriously i'm never getting rid of it i'm never really getting rid of it i love it we also got oh god i've got pins in it what's it okay so i just want to show you this this is from kate a lot of you have seen kate well it's from kate and her partner um a lot of you have seen kate on the youtube channel especially when she had miles i know you've not seen her recently but i'm 
very sure that we will be going and seeing more of Kate now without a lockdown and Miles, I can't believe how big Miles has got literally can have a proper conversation with him now and it's just, he's so cute sorry about that, I just had really bad pins and needles in my leg and oh my god, who hates pins and needles? They were, they're just the most horrible thing Portia absolutely buzzes off him like they're the best thing in the world and she's like, I love pins and needles mum it's like, you're not normal, seriously my kids are not normal anyway this is a set that came off Kate and her partner and Miles and it just says welcome to the world Minnie Mae. Obviously Kate knew the name of the baby so because she is one of my best friends well probably the only best friend um but yeah I'm going to show you what she's got us in this box I'm so glad to be able to open this now because I've been dying to take it out for days but I was like nope I'm not taking it out until I videoed it so you get this cute little teddy look at that it's just adorable seriously it's it's holding a little star oh and it's going to match a room this up and put it on a shelf which is just cute and she's got a dummy clip with a name on and i've still not had one made yet i need to get one done um so she's got this for some of the dummies and some of the summer stuff so i'm going to save this for the summer because it's summer colors and then it come with this adorable little cover so i'm going to use this in a moses basket actually because it'll go with that corner more i kind of keep swapping and changing of blankets um to see which one she likes the best but this is just cute look at that how adorable is that love it it's got little teddy bears on little stars and yeah Oh God, I really don't want her to grow up. You don't even know how much I don't want her to grow up. I want her to stay that tiny for good now because she's just so adorable. I know I say that about all of them, but she is just adorable. Okay, so we're going to carry on and this stuff is off Dave's mum and I'm obsessed. If the camera's moved, I do apologise, but... We run out of space. I need to get a new memory card for this GoPro because we are actually using, I'm not too sure whether this came with one to be honest. I think it might have done but it doesn't have very much like memory on it. So anyway, these are off Dave's one. I'm going to start from the beginning because I don't know where it cut off. So anyway, this is the first outfit. I'm not too sure how good the lighting is in this room because it looks very yellow to me. If it looks really bad on the camera. I do apologise, but anyway, this is the first one. How cute is this? And I don't know even know what that says. I think it's meant to say no, no baby or something like that. I can't even make out what that's meant to say on there in the little dots. I mean, I like this, but I'm not too sure on this style at the top. I'm not sure whether it's something I go for. This one, I absolutely love. This is just so adorable. Look at this check this out how cute is this I mean they are different when she's got them on she might really really suit them and then this one is just the cutest seriously look at this it's got like a little checkered top a little tutu middle and then just so cute but I kind of feel like these are more wintery so I'm not even sure what age she's got these in because they look more three to six months than small. So I'm hoping that these will be ideal for like the beginning of winter. Um, I should imagine she'll be as big as that by then. With a bit of luck, they will fit and be nice and warm at the start of winter. She also got me this, as you know, I am crazy when dave's mum buys me cream she always gets me the loxitan if none of you have used loxitan seriously it is the best cream and body lotion and soaps seriously i've ever used in my life it is just amazing um there is a a loxitan hand cream i've said this many times it says it's for hands i literally use it everywhere like my face my feet if you've got dry feet 
you use that on your feet and I used it once last night my feet were so dry and you would never have thought that they were as bad last night because today it doesn't even feel like I even had any dry skin on my feet that's how good it is so I 110% recommend it seriously I'll even if it doesn't work refund you the money <laughs> that's how positive I am um that it'll work but this comes in this cute little box probably she was like mom i really like that box i was like do you know um but yeah it comes in this and inside it you get a loxitan shower gel a loxitan a loxitan body milk a loxitan illuminator i think that's for hands and body i'm not too sure i've never used this before so i don't really know what it is um and then you get the salt which smells absolutely amazing so and then you've got penelope in the background having a little nose <laughs> dying to get a head in Hi. <laughs> um it's nearly bedtime now isn't it we're doing this quite later on at night just got the baby in aurora to bed um so yeah anyway i just wanted to show you some of the bits that we got obviously there's still other bit there's a couple of other bits that um imogen got us but because i've already shown the majority of that on mother's day and it was a mother's day present i kind of didn't want to take it away from being like a mother's day present but the majority of it was for me and the baby because that's what i asked her for so like I said, you can go back and watch that the Mother's Day vlog. They're cute, aren't they? Um, but yeah, if you want to head on over and have a look, then you can do. I just want to show you this one last little thing that Dave, oh, yeah. I know that. That Dave bought me, which is just... Oh, it, so I just, cute. It is so cute. But so, because I love Marie. Marie is like my favorite disney i wouldn't say like my favorite disney character because i think in fact yeah she probably is my favorite disney character have we saw her at in disney? cartoon have we saw her at disney yeah we've seen her at oh disney. it starts with a mermaid and yeah. obviously Murph for minna so dave got me this oh. because it's got marie on it and it's got the m for minna so how cute is that i'm World gonna put this on a shelf actually now and then I can look at it all the time. Oh guys, these. So, I've got these two little ones, haven't I? Yeah, and then you've got bigger ones, haven't you? Yeah, yeah. You can't see them there. These are, I'm going to get them. <laughs> okay, so we've just run out of space as Penelope was going to look for a thing. So, so we've got a bit of space. So, this one's a llama. This one's a unicorn. Um... This one's like a snail one, and it actually smells at the back one. I know, but I can, can smell them really strong, girl. <laughs> and laughing? this one is, um, what is it? Does that one not talk? No. Only if you get, like, the... This one, Daddy said it does talk because it had, like, that thing, but it... Oh, a little button. button. This one looks like a flamingo one, but like a different colour. Yeah, flamingo. it does look like a flamingo, doesn't it? And this oh, or it could be like a parrot. This one is my least favourite. Like, this one is a 10 out of 10. Oh, then that, uh, 100 out of 100. I'll tell the guys about that shop we went in that had the parrot in. Did you come with us that day? And it kept going, hello. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it was cute, wasn't it? Yeah. What was his name now? Jeff. I think it was Jeff. Something like that, I can't remember. Oh.